What is up, YouTube? I am here in sunny San Diego checking the parents' uh, solar roof. It is still, it's been a few months since we installed and it looks incredible. We still have to paint the house, but this roof was $26,000. That is a 1,300 square foot roof, four kilowatt, uh, 4.15 kilowatt hour uh, panels uh, in terms of production capacity. And uh, this same roof, after the price increase, is now over 42,000 for the simple and almost 50,000. It has almost doubled in price. And the determination that is complexity, which the average homeowner, I don't know if they know how complex their roof's going to be. Basically Tesla, this, this happened with panels, this happened with the roof, is basically they come out, they take your roof off, there's damage, there's things that need to be replaced. They have to come out multiple times to fix them and then the cost because you're only committing to the 26,000 even though you have to pay for the repairs of rotting wood or termites or whatever else they find they have found that you know when it rains there's leaks there's not not into the house but like uh, if it's attached to a pergola they had to come out three plus times to try and fix it they were unsuccessful and every time they do that it's eating to the margins of the local roofing company they contracted for the roof so there are other complexities that I'm not mentioning um, that are happening, and thus the either to curb demand and or offset the risk of those costs, they had to raise the price drastically. So this is just something to be aware of. It, it no longer makes financial sense to just get panels to offset because adding you know twenty thousand dollars to the cost of this roof for nothing else but the same production, um, the, the offset's impossible. So if you're really looking for aesthetics at that point. Um, and then hopefully what will be interesting is the tax credit. So the other thing to keep in mind is of that 26,000, not all 26,000 is eligible for the federal tax credit because not all of your roof is solar. Only 16,000 of that 26,000, uh, we can get that 26% back. So what is unknown and probably a good question if you are still moving forward is to ask Tesla if this, for example, this roof almost doubled in price, what percentage of that are they basically upcharging the solar itself? Because if they still leave it at 16,000 and then you're still paying the difference for the price increase, which might be the case because the cost is not the, the solar tiles themselves. It's like the extra margin they need to potentially come out for complex roofs. It's even worse. You won't, you'll get 26, you'll get 4,000 back. So really you're getting 10% back or less on your solar tile roof. Um, instead of what you might think was 26%, in which it never even really was. It was a lot less than that since only two-thirds of the roof, it feels like, is eligible for uh, tax credit. So that's just something to keep in mind. I hope this is helpful. There's definitely going to be more updates. Tesla's going through a lot of growing pain still, and uh, just something to keep in mind. Thanks.